Hey troops, what's going on? Gen Dick Commando here and welcome to the channel guys. So today we're going to be reacting to Indian Army Nation First. It's a video that's been recommended to me and yeah, here we go guys. Please like the video, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, hit the notification button. Let's get straight into this guys. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. We've got a tank coming out of nowhere. Um, India's got a massive arsenal of uh, weaponry and kits such as this, so I wouldn't be surprised if we saw a lot of tanks and stuff, guys. This looks awesome troops this looks good it's like a, obviously like an advertisement type thing for the military um it's not like you know probably the actual footage but it's um it's definitely here to highlight the indian military and what they've actually got um in terms of capability yeah so a lot of training footage and things like that Some nice artillery there, guys. You don't want to be in the way of that stuff. Right, we're in the mountains now. Okay, so mountain leader type um, specializations we're looking at here, similar to the British uh, military, okay, the Royal Marines, which I was formerly a part of, um, have a fantastic mountain warfare section, um, and our capability is, is probably, that's our strongest capability, I would say, the Arctic warfare, the mountain warfare, so mountain leaders is something that are really, really respected in the Royal Marines, and I'd imagine the same in the Indian Army as well, it's a real tough job. This looks cool, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yes. That's cool. That is very true. If you didn't see us, we are doing our job. And I'm guessing we don't see a lot of them because they're doing the job a lot of the time. Indian Army, you guys, you guys are good. Getting into the tropical jungles now. The jungle troops, if you, if you haven't been in the jungle before, especially in a military capacity, it looks beautiful, it sounds great, it is one of the most hardest environments you could possibly work in. Trust me, everything wants to eat you. Yeah. Okay, so... Jumping out of the water like that, although it looks pretty cool, it's not something that, you know, would be too practical in any situation if you think about it. 
how long can you hold your breath underwater for anyway? So effectively, you've went into the water holding your breath to just jump out. It's not really um, a tactical thing. It's done more so for show and for promotional um, reasons. But yeah, we, we never really went through hiding underwater and then popping up. Um, your weapon doesn't work as well as it should do as, as well, if you think about it. So... Yeah, these guys look real, real good, to be fair. The weapon systems that they're using, the training is really tough as well. They go through uh, quite a lot of specialist training in India. And it's just the sheer size of the army, guys. It's huge. Their military is huge, man. Wow. Whoa, that's nice. Jumping out of planes is something that I didn't do um, in the Royal Marines. It's a parachute regiment that you you got to really go to do a lot of that kind of stuff. Although there is parts of the Royal Marines where they do get parachute trained. Okay, guys. Um, yeah, it looks pretty cool. That looks awesome. I would love to do that one day. Indian Army nation first right then guys so that was a bit of a short one today but um, I just want to do a little bit more um, to showcase India and their content their military they've got loads and loads of videos out there so I thought you know we're gonna start doing a lot more reaction videos to India before for that reason alone okay and I want to I want to gain a little bit more knowledge about the Indian Army and the components of it because I watched one video before and it didn't really do you guys any justice and I've done a little research and watched other things and you know Indian Army is a massive massive military all right with some fantastic parts of their military as well so I want to give myself more information in the process so hopefully we get a few more people on board and yeah look forward to more Indian content guys because uh, it's worth doing all right and I like this one so if you liked it please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already troops but other than that I'll see you next time Peace out.